you know, we're making so many resources that, you know, let's go with the flag cannon because it's not repeatable. Why the hell not? Why the hell not? What's this bastion doing here? Go away. Uh, you. I don't care about you either. So you go. We'll shift. Here, here, and then I need you. Is there a way for us to get in here? No, we're not. Just go here and we'll declare war on those guys. We'll take care of this station later. Don't need to do it right now. Get rid of that. There's dark matter there, so that is actually quite fancy. Where is you? So, build mining. Get dark matter. So they can start ticking. Uh, resolutions, resolutions, let's see. So we're 27, we're 7k larger than anyone else. <laughs> I love that. Seriously, when is the first fleet coming back? And also, what the hell are you? Go away. I think, yeah, th this is another station, right? No, here, um, Epica. I'll keep this one. I'll keep this one. We still need a location for the first uh, for the fourth fleet. So right now, let's go with. Wait, what's it? What? Yeah, okay. I'll keep that one. Let's go with battle stimulation and upgrade. Who died? No, oh, the governor died. Such a shame. Such a shame. Let's just get a machine to do a man's work. Uh, the what could possibly go wrong? Okay, so the fourth, the fourth fleet. So the fleet is back from the first, first one. But the why, why, why not? Why, why don't? No. Okay, let's merge these two up. How long? So, two more months. Actually, one month. Uh, we'll need to eradicate these fellas. Come on, we'll take this and we'll let the AI take over while we start war with this fella. Yeah, I think we got to a position where we don't really care about how many wars we're doing. Fleet command limit. Naval capacity. That would actually just help me the most. Food from jobs. Who cares? Nobody... Get rid of that. You. Are you able to build me a bloody something? No, we're still... Due to the immense requirements, qualified technical person. We can only build a, or upgrade one. So we're still doing the ring world. Yeah. Still doing the ring world. So in three years time, we can start building a Dyson Sphere. <laughs> Why do we need a Dyson Sphere, actually? It's not like we are having less resources. Uh, flat cannon. The defensive platform Final doesn't... Okay, let's get the missiles, it's not repeatable. And at some point I would like to go to war with some of these guys. So the first fleet's back. Um, yeah, do we need to heal up? No, not really. Let's go here, both of you. Let's... Go to fleet management. Let's see. Can we actually increase? No, we are unable to. Hey, man. <laughs> I was lucky. I was lucky. So, okay. So, Origins, you know, it, it kind of destroyed the entire game as well. Um, did you do a ring world start? So, I did the Ringworld start. You know, if, if people, and I'm not going to advertise it all the way, if people want to see the start of what I did and, and some of the, the horrors I had to deal with, um, I, you can always look it back at, at YouTube. I got everything chopped up in 30 minute portions. So, um, but uh, we were actually banned towards this small region of space, right? So, this, this, this bit. And the guy next to me. And there was a guy here and three others in here. So, and these three, they were in the Federation, but he was not included. So, what actually happened is they started warring. And he was strong. He was strong. And he held back these two. Well, I started chewing away this fella. 
and focus research we got 7k research we are the leading entity in research let's take a look actually if we could i can no they're still very much <laughs> advanced in research but we'll get there uh, we'll get there we're working on the uh, the other green world but yeah man i was lucky i was extremely lucky we have a lot of available jobs entity is a bit of a problem um yeah they will go they will go it will start going upwards slowly right now are the decisions that i would like well stability is always good because that will just increase that planetary pacification protocols initiated uh when we get the uh the ring world uh i usually start ring world but not this yeah ring world is just overpowered uh what did you start with and what the hell is that uh damn it um let's take a look because my, my wife is actually texting me for a second here um why are we going down 316 relic world Ooh, they used to be so strong have achieved all objectives construction they used to be so strong the relic world i kind of feel that it's been left out a bit it needs a bit more love you know i feel if, if you don't go ring world Planetary it's going to be a struggle <sighs> yeah i don't know man the relic world i love that i actually have a few i believe somewhere but it's cool you're learning the game on admiral i, I really uh, uh hey, that's great yeah it actually is is, is, is really good um, I, I love the stronger starts. And it's difficult. It's difficult. So if you're going like Admiral, uh, you already start with a handicap, right? So the AI is already receiving a bonus. And how bad, how bad is this? So that's already that's going for it. Um, the AI is receiving a bonus because you're in a high, high skilled game, so to say. Um, Uh, you, you're going to bunker down. Bunker down. Focus, resource, uh, research, but do not neglect your alloy production. Make sure you keep your fleet strong. Look for an opening and go for it. As, as, at some point, you'll, you'll notice that your fleets are going to be absolutely strong. As for ships, uh, the second you get cruisers, um, you'll go with strike crafts. Uh, the second you get battleships, um, you, you'll still have corvettes, you still have destroyers. Once you get battleships, you'll start to replace these two, destroyers and cruisers. And get, I think it's the sun, no. Yeah, you'll get this one. So, the arbitrary over here has three strike craft uh, ships. You still need ships to hold people off because the second they hit you you are going to be screwed <laughs> um, they're great ships for when you have range if you don't have a range you're you're basically just you're, you're effed uh, so keep your corvettes uh, corvettes i like to have these weapons on shield penetration and armor penetration 100 percent so they immediately go attacking your hull points and that's amazing uh the missiles just for that uh hull shield penetration and they will start doing uh armor damage and additional hull damage i like that in combination with the arbitrary because strike craft they do additional armor damage but not shield damage they penetrate shield damage so he will keep his shield while his armor is going down while his hull is going down and in that these ships in combination with with this ah uh, that's oh that is so evil that is so evil uh second one as soon as you got neutron launches go for it uh the arc emitters again again shield penetration armor penetration there is an option for you to take down ships without taking down armor and shields so yeah as for the management uh, economy economy is so important
So sorry for that. And my, my wife is texting me. Um, just, just just make sure you you bunker down, build a lot of stations, and hold off the enemy. Find an opening and go for it. Once you got that, I still need to find a way for devouring swarm. Yeah, that's it's, it is super important. It, it is. The ships are what's going to keep you alive. Build star bases. Build star bases. The first stations I built, this one, but it was my choke point. And it is still my bastion. And I'm using hangar base because, uh, once again, um, they give you the highest number of, of, of power in comparison with missiles and lasers. So uh, that that's why you go hangar base. Uh, and what, uh, They're strikecraft. So shield shields uh range they got uh what's this again combat disengagement chance so the enemy as soon as they are stuck in your system they cannot jump out as soon so you will take down more ships uh and this one disruption field is just for the yeah i don't know why it's for when my fleet is there but you can also go with defensive grid if you want to go defensive platforms i've never used defensive platforms because i don't like that I built, let's not upgrade that to Citadel, I don't like building something that's like 2000 alloys or two, uh, 314, and it gets destroyed in the very first wave, that's just, you're just destroying two corvettes, that will potentially be a lot stronger than this defensive platform, so just go bastions, bunker down, and when you see an opening, just go for it, just make saves, make sure you keep saving, um, and go back if things fail and 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 look at your game and tell what did i do wrong when do i wrong it costs so much and defense platforms can't evade or disengage true they just sit there they're just useless they just are there to get destroyed ah you know the, the bad the sad thing is that uh, actually that my phone was telling me that um, uh, father is back and we are constructing my house that would mean that i would already already have to start ending this i'm sorry guys ah shit i really hate it uh, can we actually can we can we build something over here no can we at least start construction of it no we're still will we we're, we're waiting for the ring world over here 841 days wow i do a lot of talking these days oh one of you is doing consumer goods again oh. what do we get the energy beam lasers that's just lovely that is just lovely we could go energy, but we're making so many energy. Mm. Attack speed is also quite nice. So we'll keep these in pair. Attack speed and attack damage. So um, if, if, you're, if, you're, if you are looking for a Discord channel that could help you. Um, the Discord channel I'm part of. It's not mine. It's not mine. I don't like having my own Discord channel. I'm not that cool. So uh, I'm sharing it with a lot of other folks. And most of them are playing Stellaris. And some of them are absolutely great and are willing to teach you the basics. Some of them are great and extremely annoying. So you'll have to deal with that. You know what? Let's get successful. these 600 over here. Uh, go aggressive. He is still going there. Uh, let's start sending you there as well. Uh, missiles. <sighs> oh man, Strikecraft attack speed. That is that's pure comedy gold. But we'll keep things a tiny bit surface settlement established. the same level. 61. Do we still not have a, 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 a Titan for you? Damn. The Colossus is being constructed and the Titan is at 81%. You are building up, which is cool. You're going to be the station of the 4th. Upgrading to Citadel. Yeah, that's fine. So, right now we are still warring a pieces of the galaxy and we'll, we'll take all of it. We'll take half of it half of it let's take a look how our buddy is doing and not really our buddy buddy he doesn't re oh he's going to fail he's going to fail aren't you i'm i'm i got the resources right if you like i don't know 
There you go. There you go, have fun. Have fun, AI. Let's show you. Come on, expansionist. Prove it to me you're an expansionist. Come on, I just boosted your... <laughs> I just boosted everything. Hey, thanks, man, for the follow. I, uh, I appreciate it. <laughs> I'm unable to pronounce your name. <laughs> um, come on. Yeah, he's a, he's a yeah, driven a simulator. But we got to stick out for each other, man. Got to stick out for each other. So, yeah, he's still warring, as you can see here. And he's pushing him back. It's just a matter of systems. And then he can bunk down. He can bunk down and, and have some fun. And hopefully at some point we'll just... <laughs> I will have to kill him. Uh, but it's just uh, it's just funny. Because are you warring this one? No. Don't war this one. I'll war that one. Uh, yeah, there we go. We killed this guy over here. So that's nice. Uh, let's go send you over there. Do we need to resupply you? No. I think we will do a war with this fella. Let us... Let's allow him to get these systems so I don't have to. <laughs> uh, I'm enjoying my time. I'm enjoying it. Please let me build a bloody Dyson Sphere. Please let me do it. Hostile fleet a hostile fleet asset. Oh no. Oh yeah, I was still fighting this war. Completely forgot about it. Alert. Hostile fleet assets. Ah, oh, damn it. Okay, wait. Initial jump. Go there. You go in that direction. Go here. So he should be jumping in a few days. Just please jump right up, or right on top of it, please. There you go. Let's take a look. <sighs> Let's take a look. And sometimes you see these purple uh, lightning strikes. That's when they, they the lasers start hitting. And yeah, no, it's funny. <laughs> oh, it's funny. Like it. Like it a lot. Let's. Um, we actually lost a few ships here, which I don't like. I don't appreciate that. So let's keep these guys together and go there. Um, yeah. I was kind of hoping to do a Dyson Sphere, guys. A Dyson Sphere would be nice. It would be really nice. So let's take a look. Did we get anything that is currently? No yes, we kind of did. So let's build you a sector. That's going to be important. Civilian fabricators. You know, nobody needs that. Why will we repair that? We'll do that later. Let's get a governor in here. There you go. Let's take a look because we got a new cheddar in here. Uh, we got an admiral. One, two, three, four. Yeah, let's keep the admiral. And uh, let's call you. Oh my god, I'm going to rape your name, man. Zero. I think it's zero. Zero. No. Hero. Zero. No. Hero. Here you go. You are going to be in command of the 5th fleet when we get it. When we get it. Eventually we'll get it. Just so you know. Anyways, guys. Um, yeah, I, I really hate to cut this short, but I really have to. Because, well, yeah, people expect me at, at work. So, yeah. Sorry for that. Uh, minor research. What the hell does this do, actually, again? Research speed, negative 5? No. Not doing it. No, not doing those. A begin the Galactic Market Leadership Competition again. I'll support that. I'll support it, for sure. So, yeah. Um... As for now, I'm, I'm, yeah, like I said. Now, I'm, you know what? I'll, I'll drag it on for 10 more minutes. I'll drag it on for 10 more minutes. Let's see, all of that's going to go. Mobile shipyard. We're sending in this direction, so we don't need anything else. Turn this down. The end of someone else. Cool. So, we still need to fight over here. So, I kind of don't like that my, my my transports are in there first. I don't like that. I do not appreciate it. I kind of wish that it was different. But it isn't. Uh, yeah, let's aid us in a research. And I would...
purchase your services there you go don't don't mind this don't mind this guys because we're still making 500 500 everywhere and the ai is just building up like crazy and probably ruining my economy <laughs> but i'm not going to manage 60 planets uh how many actually how many planets do we have now yeah 64 and i know it eventually it's just going to be a bloody joke so let's go you technological acquisition successful and go you that will continue uh, we got the energy attack speed let's go hit points and empire sprawl we're good so we do need it star base capacity yeah we're good army damage army health let's go with army health army health will be fine Again with the sentry array. Nobody cares about that. Go away. Complete. It's funny that my Colossus is 36,000. And their main fleet, they're not even close. Oh, this is an a lot. Oh, yeah, I'm looking forward to that. Fighting another federation is cool. We'll take all of this. And we're just slowly going there. What I would like to see is getting to a position where success. I would be able to fight um, the Fallen Empires. Let's see, what's cheapest? Strike craft damage, let's do that. Oh yeah, the AI is going to destroy my economy all, all nice, oil nicely. Thank you, AI. Uh, maybe they'll fix it. Let's see. And also, also, the further we get into the game, the lag is going to be... Well, a lot diff more difficult to manage. Let's just go to war with you. Diplomatic alert. There you go. More protocols initiated. So these guys, they, they do have an army. But we don't have to care about that. Let's get the fourth fleet into this position because they have not been doing anything and they're now ready, ready to fight. Um, first fleet. I think we can actually... Yeah, I don't know. Let's go here. Yeah. And then there. Put you on aggressive. So you can land your armies wherever you want. Uh, the Senate is in session. I'm definitely not in favor. And apparently no one is. No one likes to be a... Likes to take a hit. So go on. Just come on. No, come on. Push these guys back. You know, my economy is fine. But yours not. So, there's a bit of an army there, 14k. Let's get rid of these. So, let's uh, slow this down a bit. Uh, second fleet, what's this? Uprising? Mm, let's just engage that. That's fine. The stel Stellarite Devourer? Who the hell are you? Oh, that looks so good. <laughs> it's, been a, it's been a long time since I saw that one. So, let's not get into that system and then go there. For now, we'll lock these in. We'll deal with the, uh, the uh, Leviathans later. At another date. Not right now. Don't feel like it. Okay. This is going on nicely. Just go there. Um, fourth fleet. Let's be aggressive. Go immediately into that position. Oh man, this is going to be a... We're going to be taking a lot here. Let's take a look here. Yeah, I would like to get my fifth fleet up and running. Fifth fleet would be so nice. 8k research right now and we're still building that one up. Uh, that's the gateway. I didn't mean to press the gateway. Wow, these gateways go all over the place. Alert. Hostile fleet assets detected. Let's take you. Hostile fleet. Wow, really? My economy is taking a nosedive. 
So he's going to be moving in, I believe. Planetary pacification. There we go. Planetary pacification has begun. There's two ways into my system. There is a bunch of hostile scientists in my area. Interesting. Why are you there? And who the hell are you? Why are you sending like this, this armada style my way? And why are you thinking you can go through my territory? Actually, let, let them deal with the... Um, they're actually at war with with this fella still. And oh, yeah, they already took this. That's nice. They will just finish my war for me. Not like we actually care. Man, it's been a long time since my economy took a no nosedive like this. It's probably due to consumer goods as well. Consumer goods is taking heavy on the minerals. Round and my fleets are all out. All objectives. So, there we go. Next one. Let's take this planet. Let's see. Oh, actually, there's a bunch. You're going to be staying on aggressive. You go ahead and do something, mate. We don't own the uh, starbase. Interesting. We actually do. Planetary pacification protocols initiated. Yeah, this shouldn't be taking a long time. So far, so good. Let's do the relic activation. And we'll wait until the economy goes up. It's a matter of time. Invasion units have achieved all objectives. Okay, let's put them on aggressive again. There's a third planet in there. Uh, my fleets are about to enter the system and that... That's a nice looking fleet. Let's just jump you in there. Before he gets killed. You know, I would hate that. They developed a new skill. Rigged programming. Yeah, I really hate that. It's always, always something that's just annoying. Same with this guy now. Leader experience gain. And he's so young. He will take this in. He will go in. Come on now, jump. There we go, right away. There we go, that's what we want. Go send in the troops. We'll annihilate this fleet. So he's not in this fight yet. Okay. Then by mode. Yeah, I'll have to deal with this shortly. But it's a matter no of a simulation. That's the problem. Army health has increased. Let's take a bit of food. What else do we get? Uh, shield hit points. You know, let's go with some more energy. Man, don't don't kill my oh man, they're killing my armies. Bloody hell! Uh, Ring world restoration has been done. So can we now? Kind of like, can we start the Dyson sphere? Yes, we can. Build that Dyson sphere right over there. Yes, stream goal. Check. Uh oh, game froze. Check. Technological acquisition successful. Uh, Strikecraft damage is always nice. Strikecraft speed. Let's take it. Uh, how bad is this? You lost a lot of... I was like, why is that happening? Man, we lost a lot here. I hate it. Armies are none. Planetary when we take this, we can immediately start recruiting. Let's make at least one. Okay, let's let's just tell this off. Let's turn this off. Let's fix my economy for a while. It's weird that the, the AI is now doing like this. Yeah, I am aware of that AI. I did that myself. Because you're just just building. You're building, 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 and it. What the hell are you all building? Actually, this doesn't look that bad. Science. Well, I don't need science here, mate. I have crap ton of science. I would rather... No. Look at this. 
don't. And again. Why are you attack world again? Why? Mineral. Yep, the AI is absolutely insane. Let's help you. Construction complete. There you go. Seriously. Look at all my my economy just going down the drain because the AI is just building like an idiot. I knew that. I knew that was happening. And I did nothing to stop it. Mining districts. That's fine. It's going to be fine. Can we actually buy some of these? You know, it's, it's hilarious if we could. That would be so nice. Anyways, guys, that's it for uh, for me today. Unfortunately, I was kind of hoping that I would be able to go on a bit longer than this. Uh, it is what it is. So, um, on my page, link to Discord if you feel like joining a Stellaris community. And... If you want to see the beginning of this series, just uh, go to my YouTube channel. Uh, check it out. And uh, yeah. Cool. Anyways, guys, thank you. And I'll see you next time. Have a good one. Bye-bye.